Hi guys, welcome back to Rome Total War, where we are continuing our Julii Let's Play, playing the original Rome Total War. Now, last time we took Narbo Martius, um, and we built up quite a bit of our country, a lot of movement of our troops, and uh, we also defeated the army here and took Halicarnassus, so we've got another wonder, which gives us uh, building time reduction, which is good, and this uh, Temple of Artemis at Ephesus. Um, reduces new religion buildings by 30% uh, of their cost. Orders. So it looks like we're going to be taking that next time, uh, next turn, or maybe two turns. If that Pontus army moves in close, I'm hoping they don't go into the settlement, but there is a rebel army in the way. Um, now, the Greeks have a reasonably large army, but it looks like it's just pure trash. Um, they've got some Cretan archers in this one, but should be okay. So we need to fight this battle at Pergamon. So let's see how we do. It's only wooden walls, which is kind of uh, not amazing because what I'd want to do is get onto the stone walls and shoot down at all these guys. But seen it as it seen it as it is, wooden walls should be okay. How many do we not? How many battering rams do we have? Okay, we've got six. We've got loads. We don't, don't need that many, but it's okay. We'll probably use the uh, Thracians and the Velites to take the rams in. They have got a couple of other units of cavalry, but I don't think they'll be too much of an issue. Could, but I don't think we've got hoplites in this army, but we'll send in the Prinkapes. They're reasonably armoured. They should be able to take a charge. Um, and we'll use the archers to kill the general. So, so let's listen to what he says. We Romans never seek war, but having come to battle, we will not leave until it is over. Over there stands the Greek army. They make a fine show and are worthy enemies. They stand alone. No friend has come to this place to die for them. Does this not say something about their honor? They're standing among nations. They cower behind their walls and pray for help. Our numbers are vastly superior. It may not seem fair, but we are not here to be fair, only to win. They are strong in cavalry, and this will require inventive thought today, as we lack enough spearmen to counter them. The hair has been gutted, and the liver was as clear as day. Portents such as this can only be considered good. We go now to our bloody business! We So into battle and it's a... Is this a city? Let's have a look at the governor's mansion. It's a governor's palace. So I assume... Is it a minor city or is it... I can't remember. Um, yeah, cool. So you guys drop the rams. Velites, you're going to go for the middle one. Now they have got the wooden ones, the wooden walls, so that means that we will be being shot by towers. So Thracians over here, and I think that should be enough. Now in terms of the archers, that's who we want to get be getting in there first. And then these Astarte and Prinkabes, you're behind. And the cavalry, we should really need, but we might need the generals, so bring you up front. Now let's go. Now archers, get ready to go. Sprint there, I would like you to be firing at these guys if you can. Especially their general. Only the Grecians can fire because I want these Thracians to be shot at. I don't want to lose my archers, I prefer the Thracians to be shot at so to bring you through. One of these archers has three experience, which is pretty good. I can't remember what from. I think it's because they're the ones that we had we've had from the very start. Yeah. I assume that's only the Cretans. Yeah, these Roman archers do not have good range. Only the Cretans again. How about here? Surely the Thracians are getting shot. Right, Cretans, I want you to fire at the general's bodyguard while we've got the opportunity. To 
you've got three. Now all we would need is just some hoplites or something. Our soldiers have reached the gates with a battering ram. Doesn't look like we're killing any. Oh, we killed a couple. It's all right. So we're firing at the militia cab now. Shouldn't really need to uh, worry too much about them. They're very, uh, they're armoured like so little it doesn't matter too much. Now do we want to take it from both ways? I think we do. There's one way that's clear over here and one way that's clear over this way. This way is probably better for the arrows just because there's not the trees in the way. So we'll bring the archers down here with some Prinkapes and Hastati and then we'll uh, bring in uh, some Prinkapes the other way. Actually we might split them because we don't really want to uh, and them Cretans. You come. You just come back and stand here. Don't need you being shot at. See, taking on these hoplites, even though they're, they're, they're trash units, um, it's going to be kind of hard. Right, we'll get ready. We want to be firing at their generals in all in all uh, honesty. Bring you guys forward as well. Try and stay away from the towers. Now, Velites, can you fire? Not doing much. How, how about we do this? Looks like those hoplites want to get shot. How's that cavalry doing? They're not going to be able to get their hoplites here in time, so they don't have their general too close. We are. Very nice. We'll send the Thracians in straight away. Get rid of that ram. I don't care about it. Yeah, it doesn't like we lost any of those guys. Now, we'll get our bodyguard to stand here. Well, there's Darty. We want you in next, so you come through. Thracians just instantly uh, broke. Not too much of an issue though. The archers should be firing at these guys. Yeah. Looks like they've got more right. It's their shield, I reckon, that's probably helping them most. Okay, we'll go up here. Okay, you. And you one of these guys that's already in here quite a bit. Attack. No, just get in there, just get in there. Don't care about the the ammunition. They won't know what to do now. So even though they've got their spears out this way, should be able to route them. They're wavering already. And these guys are not fast. Start bringing you guys in slowly. Surely you're going to... Bless you... Yeah, they're broken. They should all die now. Right, four of you. Want to come here? Three of you. Bring over this side. Okay, are they bringing their general? No, that's Greek cavalry. It's okay. Who are you? You stay. Thracians. Start firing at them. You two. Yeah, they. What are they doing? Ah, uh, they don't know what to do here with the script. They have to go down the road for some reason. Okay, they broke. They kind of broke their own cavalry. Who are you? You look like. Okay, your archers. I was going to say you look like a starter. You keep chasing these down. Four of you shouldn't be. Should be too much of an issue to walk here. Send the actual general across this way. Now the archers bring you this way as well. If you can get there, that would be very good. Uh, now you guys, uh, we'll bring actually the cavalry in this way through at the back here. You won't fit, will you not? OK, 
okay, that's fine. Um, and yeah, you guys. Well, you're gonna get charged again, but that's no issue. Okay, Principes. Oh no. Yeah, well, we want we want uh, Amulius on this side. You guys all fire at will. Um, yeah. Don't want to get them too tired. They're warmed up. It's all right. The archers. Who are you firing at? Oh, the Thracians are going for it. Right. We want a heavily armored unit at the front. So let's get this Prinker base. We yeah down to here with maybe two Astarte behind them. And then archers, just get here. So we'll just get here, really. They should all be able to go down there. I don't know whether they will be able to path it, though. You can come up to here. General, will be in the middle. Okay, the Equites, yeah. Velites, uh, Velites. Shouldn't really need you too much, but okay. Well, what was that? The Greek cavalry again? Yeah. Don't need to be firing at that anymore. To be fair, the people we want to be firing at are these generals' bodyguards. It's three of them. It's kind of crazy. Prinker Bay is getting position. Probably stick you on guard mode as well. Okay. Looks like they're going to bring their their bodyguards over this side. Not ideal. Um, Equites, we want you to run, and Velites, we want you to run as well. Maybe not. We'll see. If we can get some shots off at them, though. Don't want to do that. Right, you come up to here. This can we fit you in there? Yeah, we can. Now the archers. If you all just literally blob there, that would be amazing. Okay, like, uh, yeah, the Peltasts, we don't need to worry about these guys. Now, we want to be firing at the bodyguard. Looks like most of them can. Well, not most of them actually. How about the room? Yeah, the room. Looks like they can. Oh, they're going to be firing at these hoplites, aren't they? Cretans, fire there. God, their range is actually awful, these Roman archers. That range is too far for them. But as long as the Cretans are firing at them, they should come and try and attack us, I think. Speed up a bit. We want to use all our ammunition, really, before we go in for the kill, just because of those uh, the bodyguards. Now, all of you guys, can you fire at them? Okay, they're going to walk this way. That's fine by me. Do you have... Yeah. They've got... Um... No, they haven't got many left, actually. Right, now, if we could get into the square, that would be amazing. Get the archers set up. Like, or I can't double click because there's, there's people in the way. Run. Yeah, you just set up there. That's fine. Uh, General, bring you here, maybe. And Astarte. Come up to here. Thracians. Okay, they're going to go for the charge. General's bodyguard is pretty small. All of the General's bodyguards. They should lose quite a few men in this. Where's my general's bodyguard? Right, while we're at that, let's bring all these guys through. If we can, uh, if we can uh, hamper them, that'll be good. Now, you guys, I want you to get rid of the infantry. Maybe these uh, mercenary peltasts. 
yeah, come on, uh, cavalry, let's go. Otherwise, this is starting to die. Yeah, break those guys, I don't care about them. Come through, come on. Um, this is starting, this is starting, stop firing. General, let's get up here. Amulius, let's go. All these guys, I want to surround them. Yeah, they've only got 11 left. The king is fleeing. This is truly right, come through, a come through. Let's go. Bit of a ca bit chaos, but you've got, you've got to take a good bit of chaos when you can. Don't want to be charging these guys, just be charging the generals. Yeah, we completely just wipe them out. Get at your feet. Now is the time to yeah, that's the hard at his grieving subjects. Yeah, they're all dead. Nice. Um, no, don't fire your app. Don't fire, don't fire. Um, cavalry, let's get out of there. No, they're breaking. They can't break because they're on the, the square. Let's get out. No, you guys want you to charge them. You're probably going to get integrated into another unit. You can now fire. Who are you? You're all archers. Yeah, we don't need to bother about you guys. We should waver. Send this equites in just to... Okay, they're wavering, but it's because they're on the town square, they're not going to die quick enough. Send the equites in to deal with it. Nice. Okay. Yeah, we lost a lot, but they had a lot more... Uh... Yeah, it's all their starting in the Prince base. They had a lot more uh, quality in their army there. Three generals for bodyguards. Which, we got rid of three of their general. I don't know whether that makes them dead. I don't, I, that might be their last settlement. I can't see them having any others. We'll see what happens to this army. Victory! Yep, that's them dead. Good. Completely wiped them out. Um, and it's a minor city. We'll enslave. Kind of surprised that Eretium's not ready to uh, to go up in go up yet. We'll build that. Now you have a cavalry stables, which is good. Retrain the equites here. Yeah, that and what we retrain like everything. We lost a starty as well. Uh, doesn't look like we can get Prinker Bays. Have we got anyone else? No. They've got some good experience now though. We didn't we lost one archer, that's fine. Uh Thracians actually a lot of them kept their uh, uh got got revived, which is not ideal because they're the ones we probably wouldn't want to be uh, to revive. Now what do we do here? Let's recruit a present peasant so we can leave next turn if we absolutely have to. Now you guys, you have moved about these guys. Probably not ideal keeping them on the ships here when the ships are so weak, but I think I'm hoping we'll be all right in this area just because rebels generally tend to uh, go around the more populous areas. Carthage is unhappy, mainly probably because of squalor now. Yeah, look at that squalor, it's huge. Mm. Yeah, we should have probably built this. I was building that to offset the uh, population, but we might just need to just keep recruiting peasants to get the population down until they uh, until they're happy which is it's always hard to keep Carthage happy it never seems to be happy Halicarnassus you're on 70% okay cool so we've taken Pergamum that's good we're making good strides into Anatolia already it looks like Pontus is really the uh, um, the master of Anatolia at the minute I mean, they've got this and this. I'm wondering if they've conquered it all. Um, Brutii, what are you doing? Looks like you're going after Bylazora, but not very efficiently or well. And the Scipii, don't know how to take Lilybium, apparently. Probably because I've taken Carthage and these ones. Um, yeah, cool. And over here, yeah, we're done. They could potentially bribe that settlement. Um... But it's Dacia, so who cares? Like, that settlement's not going to be strong for them. It's in the wrong place. Although, they are going across. They've got a love of them, I think. The one above Patavium. Okay, the 
goals are really, really focusing on us. I don't have a, I don't have ships in this area. And also, I don't care what you think, so fuck off, Senate. Um, yeah, Lily Bynum. You'll throw some games, I don't care. Popularity games with the masses. Though ga games would be good for that. A majority with the Senate recognise your greatness but are concerned by your motives. You should be concerned by my motives. I want to overthrow you and make myself Emperor. Uh, your popularity among the lower orders is solid. You are seen as a good man and more importantly as a good Roman. Yeah, that's good. We are getting better with our with the uh, the masses. Now we've got a lot of building again, including two upgrades, which is good. But uh, we've got more money this turn, probably because we've just taken a few more settlements. Recruiting peasants everywhere, Carthage. You haven't uh, four more turns. I was going to say they haven't revolted yet. How many would it take to get it, get them blue face? I mean, ah, all of them. They're only going up to 70% with that. Do you know what we should do? Like, we should recruit all these peasants. Uh, I mean, the garrison's only 20%. So it couldn't go up to 80. So recruiting these guys actually is helping. But we can recruit them all, and then when it's stable again, we'll send them to maybe, like, Lepsis Magna? You're only a town, aren't you? Oh, let's get rid of that. I wonder how much corruption's out here. Yeah, more than what it's making. So, not not, ex not amazing. Um, I wanted to see where else we'll recruit peasants. Okay, no recruiting out here. No recruiting. We recruited in Narbo Marshes, so that's good. Now, they can come and take that if they want. I'm not bothered by it. Imperator, right. Let's uh, merge a few of these. General. Mm, I was hoping that was going to give them some experience. Well, unfortunately, we can't merge it anymore. General. Take you. Ah! I just accidentally merged it. Whoops. Gutted, but we can retrain these guys. Now, I want to test this, so we've got a silver, we've got a three, and we've got a two, and then two threes, so try and remember that. Also, these don't look like they're going to be able to merge, so we might only be able to merge one. Yeah. And let's recruit, maybe, they just lose an equity, but we need infantry out here, so let's keep recruiting uh, Hastati. Now, ooh, that would be nice, but I don't think it's needed. Get rid of, that's our Temple to Jupiter. Um, farming, we have a hostility here, so you get back. Now, they haven't moved for a turn, so once we've retrained and we've got a full stack again, let's move up to Lugdunum. It's a better town, it's a large town as well, than Narbo Martius is anyway. Uh, these guys on the boat. Bring you across. Spy. So this is owned by Namidia, who I'm pretty sure we're at war with. Let's have a look. Yeah, we are. We're at war with everyone, really. What? Carthage still exists. I wonder where. This is Rebel, so that's not Carthage. They must still have their um, Iberian. I just thought the because uh, Iberia's here, that they would have taken out Carthage already. Oh no, they've got Lily Byam, what am I talking about? I was just expecting the Skippy Eye to be competent, but apparently not. Imperator. Um, right. Got another town to, uh, to take. Prepare for battle. If we can get some field answer. battles, I would much prefer to be doing that. Seat, um, which General. one of you did we want to send across? Was it Vettius? I think it was Vettius. Yeah, we should probably send Vettius across. Now, we can retrain these guys. Um, obviously we've got we've got one slot left. Looks very much like we're going to be doing a lot of siege battles, so let's take the Hastati. We can also get triremes here. Fleet ready. Set so let's retrain these guys and let's recruit a few triremes when we can. We'll probably just we'll spend the money this turn. Order. So Attack. yeah, cool. Settlement. 
Oh, can ask this. You can have some cheap trader roads. Okay, we had a couple of upgrades. I think it was Carolus and was it Carolus and Palmer? Maybe not. Or was it Suggester? We want a port there. Um, right. I'm just going to check the armies first. So this army's here. These two armies are moving. That one's just moved. Do we? Yeah, we still need to stay here one turn. Just to get it back up to a full stack. Yes, now, master. you come Secret through here, let's see. Assured. That's a, that's their capital, Ankura. It looks very much like a town, so they might not have actually Can't dominated do this it, region. Sir. Now, yeah, they got scythe chariots from somewhere, so they must have a city or two. Surely, unless they're just cheating. They could be just cheating. That's possible, I suppose. Fleet ready. Got one ready. ship here. You guys are moving. Yes, master. You've moved. You're staying there. You're taking Sardis. And you guys are retraining and then coming up to look at them. So, yeah, I think that's it for the turn. We can build now. Um, Eretium, definitely want to build. Let's just keep going with the uh, Jupiter chain. Carolus. Um, Port, definitely. Palmer. Um, we, do we have a port? Yeah, we do. Go for the population growth. Your growth is... It looks alright, but you've not grown for ages. Carthage is still unhappy. Thermon, we can't build anything. Um, Sparta. Let's get roads. We've got a lot of building to do. Okay, we want to build that. That's probably everything out that we can do now, isn't it? Where's that? That's, oh, that's Corinth. Yeah, they're getting unhappy as well for, because of Squalor. Okay, not that many that we need to build out again, so should be okay. Um, so let's end the turn there, see what happens. Gauls are just standing there. I'm hoping they will move forward one block. We can do a draw out battle. Popularity falls with Senate, fine. Okay, we're Pontifex Maximus with uh, our Lucius Julius, I think, so that's good. Right, Patavium, you've just upgraded. Awesome. Um, need to retrain those guys. They, you, they have an infantry train, chain building. Um, but I want to go for the cavalry here. If we can train our infantry from Aretium and Ariminium and the cavalry from these two, we'll have a good little, uh, good little block going. Thapsus. Let's get roads so we can move around here a little easier. Kydonia, you don't matter. Lepsis Magna, nope, nothing. Carthage is still unhappy, it hasn't rioted just quite yet though. Okay, uh, they are like bringing all their troops together here. Secrecy is assured. But I'm pretty confident we'll be able to beat it. Our army's reason, yeah, okay, we kept the experience then, it looks like. So we had two, three, um, a silver, a three and a two, and it looks like we kept it anyway. Um, now, what do we want to do here? Massilia is happy no matter what. Let's get some peasants here. Now, we have a useless unit, this barbarian cavalry, but if we can get some more um, mercenaries, we will do. Carthage is the only place that's continuing to take the peasants. Yeah, it's not working really. Garrison is still only 20%. That wonder's helping a lot. Culture penalty. Culture penalty will be slightly gone though when we've taken uh, taken this because that will be a, quite a bit of culture penalty. And I think the squalor will reduce quite a bit. So should be... Uh, I'm hoping... Yeah, we, we... It's not good. Might just have to go and buy some mercenaries. Is there any available? Yeah, there's two. Might have to do that when we can. End of turn reports. So, um, building, that's what we're going to do. Building, and then we'll do the battles. So, Athens, what do we want? Um, you're a minor city. Wild till you grow, though. Let's take the, um, the mines. How much will you give? 350? Let's take it. Uh, that's all right. Uh, it'll take 10 turns for it to repay itself, which is actually pretty good. Uh, Larissa. 
probably keep that public order. Kydonia roads. Now mostly trading from from you probably roads, uh, but we'll take the uh, public health. That's everywhere built, I think. Um, Pergamum and Halicarnassus, yeah. And we should be ready to move out here. Let's see what they're like. Hmm. Not great. If there was one extra unit in there, would they be happy? No. Although this is going to add another five percent, I think. No, that's going to add another ten percent. So they'll be at sixty-five. With the extra peasants, might survive. I think we've got to go. We've got to. We've got to. Uh, we've got to leave. We've got to get the speed up. And I think we'll do this battle, and then we'll end the turn. Um, we'll end uh, the episode here. Um, Cyrene, let's get you making some of some of those. They only have three units here. They don't have a port, so they can't be safe. Um, and now, will it be quicker to walk to there? No, I think we go around the edge and come down. I mean, we could just even just ignore it. Uh, so we got this battle, uh, we've got the Sardis battle, and we have nothing up against Gaul. So let's go do this battle, and then we'll probably end the episode there. So let's see what we can't. Right, we'll end the turn then, and then we'll do a bit of building, and see whether we can do that battle. They might run away. Okay, they come to attack us. Cool. That's good. That's fine by me. I don't want to deal with their chariots, though. So these inf Eastern Infantry with, um, they've got 14 defense, that's why when we were attacking them before it wasn't helping too much, like we weren't doing that great because they've got 14 defense, defense skill of 6, uh, when we were charging them with their cavalry. Now the Hillmen, they're trash, um, Thracians, they're the ones that only have one hit point so they're okay. So that's that army is alright, now this is more of a traditional just standard Eastern infantry with some cavalry but uh, yeah these Eastern generals are alright and they've been fighting a few battles I wonder whether it's against rebels or who it's against now the size chariots again and we only have one Crete and archers and a, and a slingers although last time our units did well against them oh it's here I thought it was here We've got three generals and a lot of cavalry though. We should be able to do this. Just don't want to deal with those uh, size chariots. So if we can smash this army first before the other one comes in, we should be all right. Uh, oh, I should have I forgot which ones the uh, which ones. I think the, uh, the the second army is the one in the town. Let's see what this he says. Is a day of battle. While we stand together as Romans, we will not fear defeat. We will look forward to victory. The repulsive, loutish rulers of Pontus have sent their army to oppose us. Look at them all. They are very, very dangerous. If we win here today, we do far more than just defeat an army. If we win, we take a city from the enemy. We weaken them. We take their riches, their holy places, their lands, their women folk. But the winning, that is for you to do. Are you men enough for the task? We stand on the defensive today. Let them wear themselves out against our battle line. There are a few more of them than there are of us. But so what? That said, our skills, our training, and our tactics are second to none. Numbers can be deceptive. The woods nearby may give us the chance to spring a surprise or two upon our enemies. Our many horsemen will have good hunting today, as the enemy is weak in spearmen to counter them. I have won many great victories for Rome. Be strong in that truth, and let this be one more. March on, and know that our victory is assured as long as we live and die like true Romans. So he thinks that we have a much better army than them, which is actually pretty good for us. Just them damn chariots that we don't, we don't want to have to deal with. I think they're going to be coming in from the left. Let's get the high ground advantage, especially with our cavalry. We want to be charging downhill. 
Um, I'm trying to think. I think they will be coming from the left. Will they be coming from? They'll be their right, yeah, so our left. I think. Could be completely wrong there, but we'll see anyway. And you guys, you're going to be used against the chariot predominantly, hopefully, anyway. So, do we want all of these guys to fire at will? Probably not. Ah, the oh, they're coming, yeah, they're coming in from their side. Attempt to save themselves. We are on the defensive, we could wait. I don't see the need to, though. These guys will probably be far enough in by the time we've mopped up this army that it won't matter. They'll they'll still come and fight us, especially with the chariots. They think they're strong, so you're just going to retreat because I would prefer you didn't do that. That's one. Yeah, they got one general and they got a general on this this unit as well, haven't they? Yeah. yeah there he is. Um, yeah, these these buggers are just an absolute nightmare to deal with. Okay, Astarte. Hmm. It's gonna be kind of tough this battle, I think. But we'll see anyway. Yeah, they're now they're gonna charge. So Martian mercenaries are actually good as well. They just won't be able to hack it against our crazy strong uh, amount of uh, equites. Bring these guys in. They can fire one of their volleys and charge. That's good for me. They stopped their charge midway, both of us, both of us actually did. Now you go kill those Monty Light Cavalry if you can. Some Martian should break, yep. Yeah. Let's go, 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 go. The Starty and Frick Bay should be holding their own, kind of. You guys can fire, that's fine. Now those Pontic Light Cavalry are just annoying as hell. guys go for them. They're all just breaking. Not what we want. We want to be able to chase them down. We want to kill them all. Oh, they're charging us. They're charging us. The crazy bastards. Yeah, they broke though. Right, you guys get back because we're going to be facing the chariots very soon. Right, we need to get through and break these guys as quick as possible. Now this second army is the one that we want to kill all of, so we're actually okay just leaving these guys to run away right now. Alright, come through, kill these peltists, and then we should be able to kill the general. Yeah, you've broken... Yeah, that Prinkapaze is dead. Poor Prinkapaze. Kill the general. Their general's coming through now as well. Are they gonna run? No, no, they weren't going after those Brinker Bays, so surely they're going to run. Right, you. No, they're right, routing. Right, Astarte. Let's get back, let's get back. Run, run, run. Can't believe he's just running. Have we even charged him? Ah, annoying. Right, we're on the other side to the chariots right now. Could be kind of dangerous. Are you... Come here. Quick, quick, quick. And if we can, we'll fire at them. No, none of us can. Their general's here. You run. Now, this is just more of a traditional army. We can, uh. Still can't. We still can't fire at the side of chariots. <laughs> hmm. They look kind of isolated, though. So, let's go. We are not going to let them wear, us, wear themselves out against that battle line. We are going to run around today. Well, every battle we have to do that anyway. It's so much more powerful than just standing there with infantry. Okay, the side chariots, they should be in, uh, in range. The enemy general is dead! His men know yeah, they've No, don't approaches. kill these guys, kill them. Now, we want to make sure that none of these guys escape now. Come on, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. No, get out, he said. The chariots are coming, we do not want to touch them. No, you, that's a terrible formation. Should be able to run away from them. Um, are they going to start running or what are they going to do? 
doesn't look like we've taken many, any of them down. Yeah, they broke. They broke straight away. Um, now, how much of the army have we killed? Yeah, I doubted we'd killed many. Now, these Eastern Infantry, they're not as experienced as their previous ones from the other army. Um, but I still don't think they'll be able to handle us charging them. Don't want to charge them head on, though. You come round to the side. Now, this army we need to demolish. You go fight them, you go fight these guys, you go fight these guys. We need to charge down as many as we can. Get away, get away, please. Yeah, at least you listen this time. Now, these they might turn around, but looks like we're getting a mass route going. How close are they to the side? Quite far. The chariots are coming back that they're, they're like, um... Okay, we'll send you guys up here to mop up all these guys. You can mop up these guys. We need to set, we need to send some somebody, like, far over the top. So you can go after those peltists. We don't, we just don't, we just want to miss these, these side chariots, so... Maybe come back. The enemy show their true virtue. They are not Is that them all routing now? Frightened rabbits running from maybe apart from these Pontic Light Cavalry. I think they're from the first battle though, so shouldn't be too much of an issue. You chase after these guys. Right, let's continue. You chase after these guys. You chase after these guys, and then we've got one. We should have one more. You can go after the Thracians. You guys, we need to get across here. Um, get the generals sorting out these guys. Now, did we get any more? We lost one unit of Prinkapes to their general, I think. So, kind of annoying. I think they will recover though if they're the first to recover. How much have we killed them? So we killed more than 90% of both the armies combined, and I'm pretty sure we're going to kill more than 85% of this army. Two. Yeah, it looks like everyone's gone. Yeah. And that's everyone, I think. Very nice. A bit chaotic, but managed to come through in the end. A lot of dead bodies across this battlefield. Shame we lost a Prinker base though, especially seeing as they're, they've got um, an upgrade to their weapons. Yeah, we killed 1,500, they killed 200. Pretty good. Who got the most? These Rhodian Slingers got 128 kills, that's mad. And the Cretan Archers 116. They are pretty strong. Especially when they were fighting... Um... Yeah, these Prinker bays are dead. they only got two men left. Especially when they were firing at the... Uh, the chariots for quite a while. Victory! Victory! So, yeah, it's enslaved. Okay, they're gonna fight us here. But I think we leave that for the next video. It doesn't look too tough. We've got pretty experienced troops, we should be able to demolish that to be honest. So I think we're gonna leave that for the next video, but thank you very much for watching guys. Thank you.